people of all signs be equally as affected or should we look for a particular uh, sign? We, depending on what your thing is, you know, like uh, the Aries is I am, the Leos are I will, and on down the line, everybody has their own moniker of their tribe, so to speak. So yeah, th those will be, but uh, I'm sort of into galactic astrology. Yes. Because we're all on this planet flying through the universe at 70,000 miles an hour to who knows where. Yes. So we will all be going through a lot of the same uh, experiences, only just with our different flavors on it. But yeah, it's, it's gonna start then. And the further Jupiter starts to move away from Saturn, that then you're going to see all these innovations. You're, you're going to see um, uh, things coming from entrepreneurs out of nowhere that they've been working on for years and years. Here it is, and this is going to start to take away from the old paradigm that uh, you and I know so well of Monsanto, Johnson & Johnson, all these people who, who've been capitalizing on us for so long because we vote with our dollar. A woman watching your broadcast right now, mm -hmm. who's a Sagittarius, mm -hmm. I just picked that out. Her ears are up and she said, well, David just said something is going to occur uh, after the first week of January. Mm -hmm. But David also said that um, his particular practice is intergalactic astrology. Mm -hmm. as opposed to sidereal or more classical mm -hmm. uh, forms of astrological interpretation. Would you say to the Sagittarius woman the same thing that you would be saying to the Libra woman? The I always say to the Sagittarius woman, listen, you're gonna, your belief structure is going to be challenged. And you have to open up to the idea that all these things that you've been holding on to, all these attachments about beliefs, you're gonna to have to let go of. The Libra women, I, I would have to say, the things that you used to think balanced you aren't gonna balance you anymore. You're going to have to have a, a, a new look, a new view, and that's really what Jupiter is about, is our view of things. There's no belief system in Buddhism like in Christianity, but no. I have asked a great Rinpoche um, about well, what is it that Buddhists believe in? Sort of kind of like you would say to yes. somebody. And he goes, well, you know, Buddhists believe that humans have the capacity to love each other and the faith that they will.